So today is my first official day completely by myself. Sal and Brooke, my little brother and his girlfriend, just left today um, at like 6 in the morning. So all day I've just kind of been like doing laundry and getting all the towels and sheets washed. Just making my space feel clean again. I've decided to do a little 6 month revamp of the camper and kind of as well as clean everything out, just kind of switch around the way that it looks in here. Basically, I'm just trying to occupy my time since it's my first day alone. And um, yeah, so I want to show you guys a couple things that I got. Just show you guys again what my camper looks like and the before and after of this mini revamp. So for some reason, Banks has taken a liking to staying in this bunk. This is completely disorganized. This is my next project. I've got to reorganize all that, but I did clean the bathroom today, so I reorganized this as best as I can. We've never used this shower for anything other than storage, so like Banks' food, extra water jugs, my shower caddy that I bring. This was Brooke's shower caddy. Um, I might throw it away, I don't really know, but I swept all the floors and everything did the towels. I washed the blanket that Sal was using to sleep on this bed. Brooke's bin has been completely cleared out, so my next travel buddy will be able to put all their clothes in here. I had this gray blanket on there, protect it a little bit for when Banks jumps on here. When she goes outside and stuff, she always brings back footprints, so I always leave a spare blanket on top of here just to like kind of catch whatever she brings on to the bed and then that pillow I had I had two other throw pillows which I have tossed because they did not have removable covers so I couldn't wash them and get them clean and I kind of feel like it's time for a new vibe anyway I took down the string thing it was like a pink little fluffy ball banner thing that Brooke had given me for my birthday and I have something else to put up there now so let's just unload these couple of groceries here and then um, I'll show you guys what I got. Do you believe you know? Like I said, just got back from Target. These are a couple of things I had to get. I need a new paper towels. This is nothing exciting. I'm literally just showing you how I've been passing the time today as the first day alone. I got new hair conditioner. I got new Clorox wipes because I used all of them cleaning the counters this morning. Uh, some new lotion because I ran out of lotion. Toothpaste, tissues, peanut butter and jelly, face wipes, and Jesse Stafford. You made the donation so that I could get new dish soap, so I did. <laughs> Altoids for the car, and this is a new banner that I'm gonna hang up. I see them closing in, the skies are covered up, 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 up. Soon the sun will gray happen, don't you go and say So my camera ran out of space, but I'm back now. So what I got is this blanket um, instead of that gray one. Now Banks can just play on this one. And it's kind of small. I didn't realize it was going to be this small, but it only covers half the bed. But that's okay because it's kind of the only half she uses anyway. Love you. How's your belly looking? She had a rash right here, but... I've been putting medicine on it and it's going away. She's got like a f flab right here. The doctor says you're getting a little too heavy, Banks. A girl Doberman is not supposed to weigh over 70 pounds. And you weigh over 70 pounds. We gotta make things right. Gotta make things right, babe. So anyway, I got this pillow, which is literally just a dark navy blue throw pillow. That pillow I've had, that one I set in the corner so I can like lean up against it and edit and stuff. 
And then I got this banner. It's a little white one. It's got like birds and flowers and stuff. So that goes from there to there. And yeah. So what I'm about to do is finish letting this air dry. It's almost done. Get this bunk organized. I'm gonna switch out the covers on these uh, cushions here. What I really wanna do, and like I'm saving for this, cause this is like, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm looking for a word, can't tell what it is. Basically I'm trying to say it's not necessary to the health of my camper, it's just something that I really wanna do. Um, I want to get new, like cushions made, like cushion covers made. They're really dark, deep red, um, but it's kind of expensive to get those made, so I'm waiting on those. And then what else I really want to do is, I really, really want to get rid of these curtains. By the way, I'm sorry about the people. My camping neighbors right now are very loud and you can probably hear them. So I apologize for that. But basically, I want to get rid of these curtains. I really want to not have curtains at all. What I want to do, Airstream has these blinds that come down that are room darkening blinds and they're solid white and they roll down and they look so clean and beautiful. If I could get one for this window, Ideally, I would like to do it for all four windows. I've got that tiny one by the door, that one over the kitchen, this one right here, and then I've got this one by my bed. I would really, since this is the biggest one, I would really like to get it for this window, and I just think it would make the whole camper look so much cleaner on the inside and like simple. When you have such a small space, you really want to avoid anything that makes it look busy in here and I just feel like these are clunky and they make it look busy and I don't know so essentially what I'm gonna do right now is go take a shower get ready and I'm gonna go hang out with my cousin who just recently moved to San Diego so I'm gonna throw this video together and then post it and leave <laughs> and that's gonna be my day when I get back I'm gonna tackle that that top bunk and reorganize it but I don't know. It just feels really weird to be alone and it's cool, it's been nice, it's gonna be refreshing. I know that this is a really good step for me, but tonight is gonna be my first night completely by myself. It's different at night. I feel like during the day like you can occupy your mind, but at night it's gonna be the real challenge. I don't know. I might do a live stream just to keep myself company with you guys. You guys have been such a good help and are always so supportive. We'll see what happens, I guess. And tomorrow, I'm gonna clean out the car. Anyway, I'll see you guys later.